Become imitators of me, just as I am of Christ. ...that Jehovah exercises authority in a loving manner. In harmony with that, family heads and elders who love his sovereignty will not be demanding as if exercising a small sovereignty of their own. Instead, they will imitate Jehovah. Paul was just such an imitator of God and his Son. Paul did not embarrass others or pressure them into taking a desired course of action. Rather, he appealed to them. That is Jehovah's way of handling matters. Thus, that should be the way of all who love and uphold his way of ruling. What is our response to divinely authorized headship? By our respectful cooperation, we show our support for Jehovah's sovereignty. Even if we do not fully understand or agree with a decision, we will still want to support theocratic order. That is quite different from the way of the world, but it is the way of life under Jehovah's rulership.